Finding a pirate system has been on many players to-do list, especially since the Blighted Expeditions, and it's not too hard to find yourself one. We start this guide in the Anomaly as we need to go and unlock a certain blueprint to be able to find the pirate controlled systems. That blueprint we can find at the back of the Anomaly with Hyperion, the Starship Fender. We are here for the economy scanner, but first we will have to unlock the teleport receiver. Unlocking these blueprints require nanites, so be sure to have enough with you. Once we unlock the economy scanner, we can now install it into our ship. After the scanner is installed, we should now be able to scan for pirate controlled systems. It is of course possible to use the conflict scanner as well, but you need a walker brain for that to be able to construct it, and that's a little bit harder to obtain. We now need to open the galaxy map and look for a pirate system. At the moment you can see the system that I'm currently at. The little window on the right shows you a few details of that system, but below you can see a button that will expand that info screen. Now you can see the race, the economy standing and the conflict level. The conflict here is shown because I already discovered this system. If I would move to another system, you will see that the conflict is no longer showing as I do not have the conflict scanner installed. But that's okay, we only need the economy scanner to tell me everything I need to know. When hovering over a pirate controlled system, you will notice a little skull icon next to the economy right there next to the pickaxe icon. Below that you will learn more information about the types and the rates and after that you will see black market. Both the skull icon and the black market are a sign that this is a pirate control system. So simply select and warp to that system. And there you go, you should now have received the milestone. So this is how you find yourself a pirate control system, both during the expedition or in general gameplay. And that's it for this guide. If you found it informative and useful, then definitely check out my channel for more short and to the point guides. Of course, don't forget to press that thumbs up and I will see you again next time. Thank you so much for watching. This was Beeblebum, goodbye for now.